welcome to another decal wrench tutorial. I was asked today how I went about creating the cut in half words, the top of the words in the bottom in Silhouette Studio. Now I know there was a font floating around that you could purchase and at one point it was free. Of course I didn't see it was free till the next day so I decided I could easily just do that on my own. So let's show you. Here, we're going to do Jaguars. Let's select the font. And I'm going to right click and I'm going to convert to path. Because the font size doesn't matter when this is vector based, so we can resize it and we won't lose anything. So, what I'm actually going to do is but right now, make that one inch tall. And then I'm going to create, create a box. And this box, I'm going to create a half inch tall. Reason being, is I'm going to line them up together, but at the bottom. Because when I want to cut this in half, I want to make sure I'm right down the middle. Now, this square here is the middle, but when you select the knife tool, it disappears. So let's clone this, just so we have a copy. Put that off to the side. So now, since I made this one inch tall, this box is a half inch, so there's the, mi the middle. They align at the bottom. I'll select the knife tool. I will hold Shift. And there we go. Go straight across and release. Now that is cut in half. I will just select the top part. Go over here to the replicate menu, which is right there. You can see it's up to three. And they do have one that does down three already. Group them back together. Let's just change the color to align this easier. Looks about right. So then let's select this. Let's select this. And move this down out of the way. Now, if you like it like this, perfect. But if you do want a little bit spacing, like my example, Uh, there's a few ways you can go about doing it. One way is I group each row together. I'm just using selecting and hitting Control G. Control G is the shortcut for group. And then I will just go up one, two, three, four, five, six with the arrow keys. One, two, three, four. One, two. So down here. Now that is one way to do it. Another way is I just move it down to a, a decent spacing. I grab all three and then I will come over here and do even spacing. How many clicks it is, I don't know, but I know since I selected the middle Jaguar and I moved it down with the spacing tool, it's gonna to be an even grouping. It's gonna be an even space between each word. Both ways work. Either or, you now have your finished, I'm not exactly sure, cut in half stack word thingamabob. I'm not sure what this is called, actually. And hopefully, you followed along and played the at-home game. Any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below. And as always, have a great day.